Don't forget to head on to ashleytheunicorn.merchforall.com for our official Ashley the Unicorn merch today. Also, don't forget to go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter. The links are down in the description below. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are back on some more Roblox Day, playing some more Vlogs break, and today, we're gonna be doing my top 10 favorite Vlogs break hacks. So a couple of days ago, we tried the 10 most popular trends on Vlogs break, and you guys seemed to really, really enjoy that video. And I was like, you know what? I was saying in that video, why not do our own top 10 list? So I was like, you know what? We're doing a lot of building hacks we've done a lot of them like a lot of them and i was like you know what let's go ahead and rank these top 10 of my building hacks these are basically gonna be my top 10 favorite building hacks but you guys might have your own so go ahead and comment down below what your top 10 are because i would love to know like just do like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and just like you know say what your top 10 are because i would love to know but here are my top 10 favorite building hacks so if i zoom out over here we have a whole line over here i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and basically we're just gonna make each building hack on that on in that area so basically i made a list with my top 10 favorite hacks which i am not going to show you guys but basically we're going to work our way up so what that means is basically what we're going to do is start with my number 10 and then work our way up and by the end of this video you guys will know what my number one favorite hack is so stay tuned if you guys want to know what my number one is but without further ado let's get started with this so let's go in build mode i'm sorry for all those people on my plot but you know we got to get started with this okay so for my 10th favorite building hack we have the fireplace slash tv hack and this is at number 10 just because it's a really cool hack it's just that i don't know how to do it at the time so i pushed it down to 10 because you know it's a really big issue for me to do it but we did you know master it so that's good but with all the issues that i ran into with this hack i wasn't even gonna put this on my top 10 list but i have gotten so many requests on this hack you guys helped me so much so you know this hack has a special place in my heart and i just couldn't like not put it in so so for number 10, we have that hack. So let's go ahead and do this hack real quick. So basically, there's a ton of ways to do this hack, um, but I'm going to do it the easy way that I that I found. So what we want to do is get a bookcase over here and just get an empty bookcase. There are several ways to do this. So, you know, I might not do it the way that you guys like, but there are a ton of ways. So now we're going to go ahead and grab a fireplace over here. And then we're going to get the simple fireplace and you literally... Oh, wait, we forgot the TV. No, we forgot the TV. Okay, hold on. Hold on, you guys. Let me get the TV. And so now we get the fireplace and you just place it like so. And so now we have a TV with a fireplace, which is awesome and dandy. I mean, after learning it, it's a pretty good hack, to be honest. I would have put it higher, but, you know, I just couldn't do that since I've had so many issues with it and uh, you know I, I just I just hate this hack now even though it's really good so let's go ahead and jump into my favorite number nine building hack so my number nine favorite building hack is the cake stand and muffin thing okay well, let me show you guys what I'm talking about because I don't think saying it really helps so what we basically want to do is get ourselves a cake stand over here and then you just like on put it on top of each other I didn't even know you could put cake stands on top of each other but apparently you can and then basically you just put muffins around or whatever thing you want you can put like donuts around or something like that which we will try out at the end but like I have to cook food for that so we will fill it up later and go over it but that is number nine and then for my eighth favorite building hack is the pool table we made this when i was making my basement i just really like this just because it gives i don't know it gives a really cool look to it and i mean a pool table like come on it looks really awesome it's good for like a game room it's good for basements um it's very versatile and awesome so I do recommend for you guys to make yourselves a pool table because it just looks really awesome. And, you know, why not have a pool table? And it's really, really easy to make. All you have to do is get an industrial dining table and then put boxes all around the, the, the trim of it. So now we have all of the small boxes around the trim of the dining table. And then what you want to do is get some soap, like the soap bars over here. And then you just make the pool table thing. So you have three right there. And then you do a two and then a one. And then you need one right here so you can hit, like, the one that you hit so there you go and then you can also put some in the corner so those can be like the holes that you like drop in which is super awesome and then of course you have to color the whole thing and yeah that is basically your pool table and here is the finished look of the pool table after i have colored the whole thing and there you go you have a cute little pool table i mean it's just it just looks really awesome so let's go ahead and head on to number seven and my number seven favorite hack is probably the hockey table i know the pool table and the hockey table are pretty close together and that is because i love them both 
sincerely because they just make it and they just make like a game room or like a basement super awesome looking so for number seven we have the hockey table so the hockey table is a little bit more complicated than the pool table but it's not really hard to do so basically you want to take the plain quarter fence and do a two by one spot and then you want to take the steel railing cable uh railing and put it in the middle like so and then what you want to do is take some relaxed side tables and just put them in the middle like so and then after getting the side tables you want to go ahead and get some of the paper towel ones and make sure you get the ones with the thing poking out just because these are going to be your hockey sticks or not the sticks but like those hockey things that you you know shoot with so there's that and then once you do that you need a simplicity dining table and you just put it on top and well uh hold on if i could line this up that would be great and voila you have yourself a hockey table and also you want to go ahead and get some of these oval tv stands and put them in as well so these look like where the puck usually comes out of so you just want to place it like so inside and bada bing bada boom you got yourself a hockey table and voila after you color up the hockey table it actually looks like an awesome hockey table so yeah the pool table and the hockey table are right beside each other because you know what if you have a game room if you have a basement to spruce it up just add one of these because they're super easy to make they're pretty cheap as well and they look super awesome and so let's go ahead and finally move on to my number six favorite building hack for my number six favorite building hack it is the trampoline i know like what why is this number six it should be lower well let me tell you why it is my number six favorite building hack just because there's not that much stuff that you can put outside, you know? I mean, there's pools, there's gazebos, and all of that jazz, but there's nothing fun like swing sweat, swing sets? I see, like swing sets, and I don't know, just some things to play on, so I think a trampoline would look a lot it would look really cool so what we want to do for this is just get a hammock and so what you want to do is just get really close to the trampoline here and uh not the trampoline the hammock and just rotate over and over again and there you go you have yourself an awesome trampoline and you just want to paint it up here so just make this black because you know trampolines are black where you jump you can make the border of it any color you want but make sure the middle is black just so it actually looks like a trampoline and there you go you have yourself a trampoline it's super easy to make looks super awesome and you know what it just gives something more to the backyard because so, i feel like we have been neglecting our backyards and you know what this just makes it a lot cooler and so finally we have made it to our halfway point to our number five favorite building hack and my number five favorite building hack is something to do with food because as you guys know i love these food hacks so for number five i did the food in the microwave and also when you put food on the stove i don't have food currently right now as you guys know we have to cook some food but basically what you want to do is get yourself a counter over here or wherever you want to put your microwave and uh, you just take an item like you literally take any item you want hold on let's go take this mug for example and you just take a microwave over here and you just place it on top and it actually looks like you have something in the microwave and i really like this it just gives some more you know it gives some more aesthetically pleasing looks and you can put any type of food you want and so the next part of this number five favorite building hack is the one where you put the food on top of the stove so what you want to do is get yourself a, a table over here well like an end table over here so we can just grab anything to be honest so we got ourselves a primal end table and then get ourselves a cake stand over here and then we're gonna do the same thing by getting a mug just because i don't have food right now so we're gonna put a mug on top of there get ourselves a stove um any stove will do and bada bing bada boom Boom. okay we might actually need to move that a little bit to the corner <laughs> but if you play around with it um you can just put it anywhere you want so there you go you have some food on top of the little stove and it looks super cute of course you can put food whatever you want but again we don't really have food at the moment <laughs> we are getting super super close to number one but now we're at number four so let's see what my favorite number four hack is so in fourth place i put the dirty dishes hack and i just love this uh little hack you know it's really nice for role plays it's really nice if you like build your own bakery or restaurants and you just want to make it look more realistic i think this is a great way to do so so what you want to do for this hack is basically the same thing as the stove but instead you just put a sink <laughs> but i think the end table actually has to be a little bit lower so i got ourselves a log one and then what you want to do is just grab yourselves a sink it can be any sink that you want well of course a kitchen sink so we need a counter for us haha <laughs> my bad so after you put the end table and the cake stand what you want to do is get yourselves a counter and just put it on top and then after you have the counter on top of it you just want to place the kitchen sink and there you go you have a cake stand right there again you're supposed to put the food first so what you want to do is before you actually put the sink on top of the counter you want to get yourself some food of course we don't have food like i said 
So we're just gonna grab some mugs for now and then you just put the put the sink back on and there you go You have some dirty dishes. So let's go ahead and move on to number three over here We are getting so close to our number one spot How about we comment down below what you guys think my number one building hack is so comment down below what you guys think it is and uh, See if you're correct and so for my number three building hack over here is the apple tree I love this hack. It is super awesome I love it so much and so we're gonna go ahead and remake this thing and so basically for this hack What you want to do is get yourself a tree over here and place a floor on the second floor Just so you know, you can actually place some stuff And then what you want to do is move the tree over and place some, you know, end tables or whatever you want Make them green just like the tree and then well, we need apples So we're gonna get out of build mode and get ourselves some apples because we can't do this without apples We're gonna place them down and then I'll show you guys what the next step is Okay, so now we have the apples and then you just want to place them on like the tippy corner of the uh, What you call it on the end tables and then hopefully once you put the tree in it will be uh, sticking out And then you just want to play around with the tree and the tables and see what works best I mean Sometimes the tables will like show outwards, but you know if you just like move it a little bit or like move them around You just really need to play around with it. And there you go. You have a cute little apple tree I mean sure there's only two two apples showing but you know what you can make it a lot better I just you know I just second hacks as you guys know But I love this hack just because it gives the tree a little bit more possessed and hopefully in the future We can get some fruit trees or something like that which you can like pick that would be awesome So I hope we can get some fruit trees in the future, but if you guys want a fruit tree you can do this. So here we are at number two. We are getting so, 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 so close to that number one. Like, what is number one? We will never know. But before I reveal my number one favorite building hack, let's go ahead and reveal my second favorite building hack. And this is one of the new ones just because, you know, I love the new hacks. Drum roll, please. Number two is the new pet hack. So if you guys haven't heard about this, it's literally everywhere. And basically with the new display cases, you can have your own pet. So all you wanna do is get yourself a counter and you can literally make whatever pet you want. You can have an aquarium, you can have a snake, you can have a hamster. Whatever pet you want, you can have it. And this is super, super easy to make. All you have to do is get yourself a commercial counter display case, the one that goes on the counter, not the big one. And then get yourself a picture frame over here. Not, oh, well, a frame, not a picture frame. And grab a little square one, place it down over here. And then, of course, we want to get some plants just because, you know, our animals need some plants. So there we go. We can put that down. And then also just get a small box or something for their little house. And this is where, you know, they, they live and stuff. <laughs> Again, you can change their habitat as much as you want. You can put some coral in if it's an underwater creature. It literally is all up to you and it's a really creative option. So what you want to do now is just color some stuff up, you know. I mean, I don't know. Maybe they want somewhere blue to live. Or maybe their house wants to be blue. <laughs> and then I'm also going to change the display case to this a wood texture to a more dirt texture. So it can actually look like, you know somewhat like some animal lives there so we got that and then what you want to do is go to the picture frame and change it into whatever animal that you want in the previous video we got a hamster so that's exactly what we're gonna do again get ourselves a cute little hamster i mean there's just so many pictures to choose from again you can also you know put in whatever picture you want you can make your own picture you can put your own dog in to be honest like go ahead and go take a picture of your dog and put it on roblox and put it in bloxburg and there you go you can have your dog all the time but here is the finished product of our cute little hamster like hello i love you now i want a hamster really bad but like i don't because they they kind of look boring but here we are at my number one favorite building hack you guys are gonna scream when you find out what it is you guys might be mad at me for making this number one you might hate me for making this number one but you know to me this is my favorite hack just because i'm stupid <laughs> and if you guys guess this you guys are the ogs you guys watch all of my building hack videos and i love you for that you guys are amazing if you guys know what this hack is about to be and you might have guessed it but my number one building hack is hold on let's get a drum roll drum roll please is the toilet hack yes the toilet hack like girl why is this your number one I don't know. I just fell in love with it. So if you guys don't know the toilet hack, basically what you want to do is get yourself a witch cauldron or you can get a tree stump or a fryer. You can literally put whatever you want underneath. I think it just looks a lot better with the cauldron. And then you get yourselves a toilet over here and you just put it on top. I mean, it's just so good. I mean, you guys, it's the best hack ever. And bada bing, bada boom. All you have to do is go ahead and change the colors of the cauldron. So you just make that white and then you make this yellow or brown matters on white 
what type of toilet tea things that you put inside. Okay, we're not gonna get too nasty, okay? But that is my number one building hack and you guys are like, girl, this is like the most useless building hack ever. Why is this number one? It just has another special place in my heart. We have gone through so much with this and you know what? It's just, it's just amazing, okay? <laughs> and so there we go. We have my 10 top favorite building hacks. And I want to know what your top 10 favorite building hacks is. So go ahead and comment down below your list because I would love to know. Again, it doesn't have to be any of these. You can do whatever hack that you like. So, I mean, if you guys, if you don't want to put a trampoline in your top 10, don't put it. You know, put whatever hack you want because there are a ton more hacks than just these 10 so go wild go crazy and let me know what your list looks like but if you guys did enjoy this video go ahead and do me a big favor by liking the video and subscribing if you guys are new and turn that notification bell on so you guys get notified every time i upload a video i mean it would just mean the world to me since we are so close to 600,000 subscribers which is just mind-blowing like you guys are insane i love you guys so much so go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys tomorrow with another video Bye bye